Hello and welcome to YouTube channel Health Q, the place where my mission is to motivate you to look at the bright side of the health. In today's video, I would be sharing with you the top five bad postural habits of day-to-day -day life, which could be the reason behind your spine pain. Spine pain, back pain, neck pain, etc. Very common. 40% of Indians suffer from this. And one of the biggest reasons why people get this pain is due to poor postural habits. So, what are the postures that are part of your day-to-day -day life and they are so integral that you don't even realize that you are doing it wrong and is the reason behind your pain? What are these? We will understand in today's video. So, make sure to watch this video till the end. Let's begin. So, here's the first one. Slouching while walking or else using your phone. Even I am guilty of this and I think we all are guilty of this. We are so used to, to use cell phones throughout the day and this leads to one of the most common habit of poor posture and that posture and that is hunchback. Hunchback posture is one big reason for upper cross syndrome or a pain in your upper back and neck region. The reason being you are constantly keeping your head in a forward position putting strain on your neck muscles on your upper back and your shoulder muscles and that's why slouching while walking or else using phone is one bad postural habit which needs correction immediately the another common poor postural habit that many people are guilty of especially the people who have constant working hours in front of neck stops is forward neck, neck bending forward neck bending is one such common problem which could be the reason not only for your neck and shoulder pain but also in your back pain this problem is so evident and common that people land up with back pains very frequently and sometimes require immediate medical attention if you are looking in the screen, make sure to maintain your spine in erect posture and prevent yourself from going into that forward head posture or this forward neck bending in order to prevent spine related issues. The next one is a very common habit again and that is bending your back while you are sitting on your desk or else on your chair. When you sit on your desk or else on your chair and while you are bending your back, what happens at leads to a lot of flexibility issues it leads to long-term back pain and that's why it is highly advisable that you maintain an erect posture when you are sitting on your desktops if you want you can use a pillow or some support in order to maintain your erect posture but maintaining erect posture not only improves your flexibility stability but also mobility of your spine The another common mistake that we usually make is that we keep our knees straight when we are lifting something. Whenever we have to lift some heavy objects, cartons, box, etc., we tend to bend from our back, keeping this knee straight. What happens is it leads to complete turning of the back region, which disrupts or I'll say damages your ligaments and the structures around your core region, which is the leading cause for back pain, especially when you are trying to come back to the position. I have seen so many times in my clinical practice that people land up with severe back pain. It's so severe that they are not even able to walk independently and they are absolutely bedridden for a few days just because of this one particular habit. Hence, it's highly advisable that whenever you have to pick an object from the floor or else you have to lift heavy things, bend from your knee and try to maintain your spine as erect as possible. The ideal bending should be from the hip level and not from the back level. Squatting down, picking up is much more better than keeping knee straight while lifting objects. And last but not the least, the common postural habit is using high pillows, using two and more pillows or is using too soft pillow or too hard pillow. In any of the case, your alignment of the spine gets disrupted, which could be the reason why you wake up next morning with stiff neck or a pain in the neck region. Sleeping with high pillows is one of the leading cause for neck pain and also is the cause behind spinal injuries. Hence, in order to avoid these injuries, it's ideal to use a pillow that is not too hard, not too soft, not too thick, not too thin, but just exactly fits your spinal alignment. Making sure that if you are using proper bedding and proper pillows will ensure that you prevent your back pain repeatedly. 
So friends, these were some of the common postural habits that we all easily make and we are always guilty of doing them. But most important is these posture habits can be corrected and once corrected can help you to get rid of the pains and aches. But still, if you are suffering from aches and pains, especially to your spine region, we can definitely help you out. Our clinic is located in Bangalore. And if not, then you can also take an online consultation with us where our expert physiotherapist will be able to help you to guide through and recover from your back injuries. I hope you found this video helpful. If yes, make sure to like this video, share this video with your friends and family members, and do not forget to subscribe to Health Q channel. I'll see you in another video. Thank you.